Heidi Klum, pronounced Heidi KLM, born June 1, 1973, is a German-American supermodel, television personality, businesswoman, fashion designer, singer, television producer, author, and actress. She appeared on the cover of the Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue and in 1999 became the first German model to become a Victoria's Secret Angel. She has worked as a spokesmodel for Dannon and H&M, and has appeared in numerous commercials for McDonald's, Volkswagen and others. In 2009, Klum became Barbie's official ambassador on Barbie's 50th anniversary. As an occasional actress, she had supporting roles in movies including Blow Dry, 2001, Ella Enchanted, 2004, and made cameo appearances in The Devil Wears Prada, 2006, and Perfect Stranger, 2007. She has also appeared on TV shows including Sex and the City, How I Met Your Mother, Desperate Housewives and Parks and Recreation. Currently, Klum is a judge on the NBC reality show America's Got Talent. In May 2011, Forbes magazine estimated Klum's total earnings for that year as $20 million. She is ranked second on Forbes' list of the world's top earning models, behind Giselle Bunchen. Forbes noted that since ending her 13-year run as a Victoria's Secret Angel, Klum has become more of a businesswoman than a model. In 2008, she became an American citizen while maintaining her native German citizenship. Equals equals early life and discovery equals equals. Klum was born and raised in Bergisch Gladbach, a town outside Cologne, Germany. She is the daughter of Erna, a hairdresser, and Gunther Klum, a cosmetics company executive. A friend convinced her to enroll in a national modeling contest called Model 92. Out of 25,000 contestants, Klum was voted the winner on April 29, 1992, and offered a modeling contract worth $300,000 by Thomas Zumer, CEO of Metropolitan Models New York. After winning, she appeared on the Gotchik Late Night Show, a German television show with host Thomas Gotchik. She accepted the contract a few months later after graduating from school and decided not to try for an apprentice position at a fashion design school. Equals equals career equals 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 modeling and acting equals equals equals. Klum has been featured on the cover of French, German, Portuguese and Spanish Vogue magazines, as well as Elle, InStyle, Marie Claire, Glamour and Russian Harper's Bazaar magazines. She became widely known after appearing on the cover of the Sports Illustrated Swimsuit Issue and for her work with Victoria's Secret as an Angel. Klum has hosted the 2002, 2006, 2007, and 2009 Victoria's Secret fashion shows. On October 1, 2010, the New York Post reported in its page 6 gossip column that Klum would be leaving Victoria's Secret, which was later confirmed by Klum. In addition to working with well-known photographers on her first husband's Sports Illustrated shoots, she was the object and subject of Joanne Gare body painting works in several editions from 1997 to 2010. She wrote the foreword to Gare's book of body paint work, body painting, masterpieces. She was a spokesmodel for McDonald's, Braun, Dannon, H&M, and Liz Claiborne, among others. Since 2007, she has been a celebrity spokesmodel for Jordache and Volkswagen. In addition to modeling, she has appeared in several TV shows shows, including Spin City, Sex and the City, Yes, Dear, and How I Met Your Mother. She had a role as an ill-tempered hair model in the movie Blow Dry, played a giantess in the movie Ella Enchanted and was cast as Ursula Andress in The Life and Death of Peter Sellers. She had cameo appearances in the films The Devil Wears Prada and Perfect Stranger. Her other projects include dance and video games. She is featured in the 2003 video game James Bond 007, Everything or Nothing, where she plays the villain Drive, Katya Nadanova. The latter video depicts the married couple sharing intimate moments while naked in bed. The concept was Klum's idea. In July 2007, having earned $8 million in the previous 16 months, Klum was named by Forbes as third on the list of the world's 15 top-earning supermodels. In 2008, Forbes estimated her income at $16 million, putting Klum in first place. For 2007, Forbes estimated her income at $14 million. Klum is signed to IMG Models in New York City. In 2008, Klum was a featured guest on an American Volkswagen commercial, where she was interviewed by a black beetle. When she commented that German engineering is so sexy, she caused the beetle to blush and turn red. She has been a part of several commercials for Volkswagen and McDonald's on German television. In November 2008, Klum appeared in two versions of a Guitar Hero World Tour commercial, wherein she did a take on Tom Cruise's iconic underwear dancing scene in Risky Business. In both versions, she lip-synced to Bob Seger's old-time rock and roll while dancing around the living room with the wireless guitar controller. In October 2009, Klum was the often nude one-woman subject of Delicious, a photo book by photographer Rankin. Klum ventured into web-based videos, starring in Spiked Heel, Supermodels Battle the Forces of Evil. The web series starred model Coco Roca and was directed by fashion documentarian Doug Keeve. In the story, 
Clue aka the Cluminator, and her stylish sidekick Coco the sassy superhero Roka battle the evil drive, faux pas who is plotting to destroy Fashion Week. The heroines employ everything from blow dryer guns to fist fights, in order to thwart drive, faux pas dastardly plans. The Cluminator and Girl Wonder avoid a chain of fashion disasters to neutralize a death ray that threatens to vaporize the community of fashionistas gathered in Bryant Park. In 2010, Clume became the new face and creative advisor for European cosmetics brand Aster, for which she sets artistic direction and designs new products and fashion-forward color collections. In October 2010, Clume parted ways with Victoria's Secret after 13 years of working with the brand. She provided a simple explanation in her official statement, stating, All good things have to come to an end. I will always love Victoria and never tell her secret. It's been an absolute amazing time. It was reported in May 2011 that Clume trails far behind Giselle Boonchin at No. 2 with estimated earnings of $20 million on Forbes' list of the world's top earning models, 2010-2011. Forbes noted that since ending her 13-year run as a Victoria's Secret Angel, Angel, Klum has become more of a businesswoman than a model. She partnered with New Balance and Amazon.com to launch a clothing line and signed a 20-episode deal to host a new show on Lifetime, called Seriously Funny Kids. In fact, some noted fashion designers have long been commenting on Klum's limited role as a fashion model. Karl Lagerfeld, for example, in 2009 agreed with German designer Wolfgang Jupe, who called Klum after she had posed naked on the cover of the German edition of GQ magazine, No Runway Model. She is simply too heavy and has too big a bust. Lagerfeld observed that neither he nor Claudia Schiffer knew Klum, as she has never worked in Paris and was insignificant in the world of fashion, being more bling bling and glamorous than current fashion. Equals 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 producing equals equals equals. In December 2004, Klum became the host, judge and executive producer of the reality show Project Runway on the U.S. cable television channel Bravo, airing on Lifetime Television beginning in 2009, in which fashion designers compete for the opportunity to show their line at New York Fashion Week and receive money to launch their own fashion line. She received an Emmy Award nomination for the show for each of the first four seasons. In 2008, Klum and Project Runway received a Peabody Award, the first time a reality show won the award. Klum was nominated for an Emmy in 2008 for Outstanding Host of a Reality or Reality Competition Show for Project Runway, the first year that category was recognized by the Emmys. Klum has been the host, judge and co-producer of Germany's Next Top Model, the German version of the internationally successful reality television show, since 2006. All 12 seasons aired on the German TV station ProSieben. In 2013, Klum, along with her co-host Tim Gunn won an Emmy Award for Outstanding Host for a Reality or Reality Competition Program. Equals 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 design and other business ventures equals equals equals. Klum designed clothing lines, one for men, featured in the German mail order catalog Otto. She designed shoes for Birkenstock, jewelry for Muawad, a clothing line for Jordache, and swimsuits, featured in the 2002 Sports Illustrated swimsuit issue. She was one of the designers of the Victoria's Secret lingerie line The Body, named after the nickname name she received following her first Victoria's Secret fashion show appearance. Her Muawad jewelry collection debuted on the cable shopping network QVC on September 14, 2006, and 14 of the 16 styles sold out after 36 minutes. Klum's clothing line for Jordache launched on April 30, 2008. Klum has two fragrances, called Heidi Klum and Me. She designed makeup for Victoria's Secret as part of their very sexy makeup collection, titled the Heidi Klum Collection. The first run debuted in fall 2007. A second run was released in fall 2008. Klum was involved in the development of a namesake rose, the Heidi Klum Rose, which is available in Germany. For the 2008 U.S. Open, Klum designed a screen print t-shirt which was sold at the U.S. Open shop. It featured childlike butterfly pictures. Proceeds will go to a non-profit organization maintaining the park, which is home to the U.S. Open. Klum became Barbie's official ambassador for the doll's 50th anniversary in 2009, even having made a Barbie doll out of herself. On April 1, First that same year, she appeared on the CBS television special, I Get That A Lot, as a girl working at a pizza shop. That same year, she appeared in advertising for Dannon's Light and Fit brand. Klum and husband Seal announced in June 2010 that they would be making a reality series on Lifetime titled Love's Divine, after Seal's song of the same name. In January 2010, Klum launched two lines of maternity wear, lavish by Heidi Klum for AP in the pod, and loved by Heidi Klum for motherhood maternity. Klum stated, I experienced fashion challenges during my four pregnancies and combined my knowledge of what works in terms of style, comfort and practicality to create these lines. In October 2010, 
Clume with New Balance, HKNB, launched a line of active women's wear fashion clothing on Amazon.com. In January 2015, Clume launched her lingerie line Heidi Clume Intimates in Melbourne, Australia. Clume is a real celebrity on the website Stardoll, where she has a line of virtual jewelry, and a virtual clothing line called Jordash. Users can go to Clum's suite, address, and interact with her by doing interviews, sending pending requests or dressing Clum's doll. In 2015, she appeared in Australian singer Sia's music video Fire Meat Gasoline to promote her lingerie line equals 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 America's Got Talent equals 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 in March 2013 it was announced that Klum would be joining America's Got Talent as the show's new fourth judge she judges the show alongside Howie Mandel Mel B and Simon Cowell equals 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 other work equals 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 Klum is an artist and had several of her paintings appear in various art magazines in the US on September 27 2002 she dedicated a sculpture she painted called Dog with Butterflies to commemorate the role of rescue dogs in the aftermath of September 11. In 2004, Klum co-authored Heidi Klum's Body of Knowledge with Elle magazine editor Alexandra Postman. The book gives Klum's biography as well as her advice on becoming successful. Prior to that, Klum had been an occasional guest columnist for the German television network RTL's website. She wrote an essay for the German newspaper Die Zeit. In November 2006, Klum released her debut single Wonderland, written for a series of television advertisements for the German retailer Douglas. Proceeds were given to a children's charity in her hometown of Bergisch Gladbach. She contributed to her husband Seal's 2007 album System, singing the duet Wedding Day, a song that Seal wrote for their wedding. Equals equals personal life equals equals. In 1997, Klum married stylist Rick Papino. The couple divorced in 2002. In March, 2003, Klum began a relationship with Flavio Briatore, the Italian managing director of Renault's Formula One team. In December she announced her pregnancy. Soon after, the two split and Klum began dating the musician Seal. Klum gave birth to Helene, Lenny, Klum in May 2004 in New York City. Seal was present for Lenny's birth, and according to Klum, Briatore is not involved in Lenny's life, she has stated emphatically that Seal is Lenny's father. Klum Klum and Seal got engaged in December 2004 on a glacier in Whistler, British Columbia and married on May 10, 2005 on a beach in Mexico. They have three biological children together, sons Henry Gunther Adamola Dashdu Samuel, born 2005, and Johan Riley Fyodor Taiwo Samuel, born 2006, and daughter Lucilola Samuel, born 2009. On November 21, 2009, Klum officially adopted Seal's surname and became legally known as Heidi Samuel. Soon after, in December 2009, Seal officially adopted Lenny, and her last name was changed to Samuel. During their marriage, Klum and Seal renewed their vows to one another each year on their anniversary in front of family and friends. On January 22, 2012, the couple announced that they were separating after almost seven years of marriage. She filed for divorce from Seal three months later on April 6, 2012. She also requested that her name be restored to her birth name of Heidi Klum. Their divorce was finalized on October 14, 2015. Klum was in a relationship with her bodyguard Martin Kristen from September 2012 until early 2014. Since 2014, Klum has been dating independent art curator Vito Schnabel. Equals 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 bomb threat during GNTM live finale equals equals equals. During the live finale of the 10th season of Germany's Next Top Model in the Mannheim SAP Arena on May 14, 2015, a telephone call by a woman came in at 9.07 p.m., threatening that a bomb would go off during the live show. The organizer decided to have the hall evacuated and then to call the police. In the meantime, the live broadcast had been cancelled and a note was shown to the television viewers, stating that the show had been interrupted due to technical issues. Later on, a man was arrested after he came near Klum, issuing another bomb threat. Thereupon, she was taken to a secret place along with her daughter Lenny and the two other judges. A suspicious suitcase was found, which however turned out to be a false alarm. Equals equals philanthropy equals equals. On April 30, 2011, Klum led Walk for Kids, a community 5K to raise funds as part of Children's Hospital Los Angeles community awareness efforts. In May 2014, Klum was honored with the Crystal Cross Award by the American Red Cross for her charity work, most notably for her contributions to the Red Cross after Hurricane Sandy. Equals equals filmography equals 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 awards and nominations equals 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 see also equals 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 references equals 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 external links equals equals official website Heidi Klum on Internet Movie Database Heidi Klum at the Fashion Model Directory AOL Books Interview about the book Body of Knowledge Interview in Spiegel, February 12, 2006.